Previously on A Better Life Underground. Get back! Get back! All of you! I said get back! Now see here. You've got to calm down and let her go. What in the world has gotten into you, Gerald? I told her. I told her one more blasted can of Salisbury steak and I'd kill her! I said I would kill her, and I'm gonna do it, so help me! Honestly, Gerald, all this over dinner? Pull yourself together now. What's the problem with a beautiful cut of canned steak? It's the same damn food every day, Eleanor! Ah! It's steak! Ah! It's not supposed to be in a can! Gerald, for the love of all things culinary, just put down the knife and we'll let you have a second helping of Instamash! And now, episode 572 of A Better Life Underground. Wow, look at all this. This is where it happens. All the controls in the vault for the water systems are right here. I don't think we should be down here, Eddie. We aren't even authorized. My father would have my head. <sighs> now, don't be scared, Judy. Besides, how am I going to be a water technician if I don't get to see the equipment? <sighs> Check out the construction on this fill chamber. And not to mention, we finally have a moment alone in here without your father watching us like a hawk. You know, he's never approved of us being an item. <laughs> Eddie, he's the head of security. It's his job to watch everyone in the vault like a hawk. <laughs> well, he's not watching now. So, how about a smooch? <laughs> oh, Eddie, you are a bold one, aren't you? <sighs> Eddie, my arm is stuck. Can you just move a little left? Okay, hang on. Let me put my foot over here. Warning, warning. Fill chamber purge initiated. Clear fill chambers of all personnel. Warning, warning. Eddie, the chamber door is locked. It's filling with water. Eddie, do something. Judy, I, I don't know what to do. It's filling up. Where's the release valve? Eddie, the water, the water! Judith, my love, it's the end for us. I, I, I can't get the doors open. At least, at least I get to die with you in my arms. I can't die without telling you the truth, Eddie. I don't want to go with it all in my conscience. You need to know, all that time last month when I was supposed to be doing advanced nuclear studies, you Reginald and I, we... What in the name of the Overseer are you kids doing in the Reclamation Fill Chambers? You would have both drowned in there if I wasn't scheduled to check the pressure levels today. Chewie, your father would have booted me right out of the vault door by sunset. <coughs> oh, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you for saving us. We were surely going to drown. <laughs> Judith! Uh, Judy, when we were going to die in there, what was it you were about to say about you and Reginald? Well, Judy, what was it? What were you going to say? Eddie, I... Next time on A Better Life Underground. Jeez, Bill, I've got the goat test coming up in less than a week, and I don't know a single answer. How am I ever going to get myself ready in time? I'm sunk. For serious. Why did I spend all my time playing stickball instead of studying? <laughs> well, Frankie, you've come to the right place, my man. <laughs> you ever hear of... Kens? What? Uh, where do you get those? We're not supposed to have Kens? But... If it gets me the best goat job, I'll do anything. But I'm so afraid of needles. <laughs> don't worry, Frankie. These drugs don't go in like an injection. These babies are chewable. It's a straight line from pill to progress. That's all I needed to hear, Bill. 
The Junior Vault Security Patrol has been waiting a long time to find out who's been peddling these poisons. Your game is over.